Yo, what is going on guys? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to create your own cheat codes for free using the Cosmos Beginner Cheat Tool. Now this tool can be found over at cheathappens.com. The link is in the description. So go ahead, download the software to your computer to get started. Now, once you've downloaded, you wanna go ahead, store the program somewhere on your computer. I usually just save it on the desktop where it is super convenient. Keep in mind, this software will be run solely from this folder. It will not show up on your application list. Now, if you are new to this kind of thing, don't worry at all. What I'm about to show you is completely beginner friendly and it is totally free. Now, by using this tool, you can create your own cheat codes. No need to wait on the team at Cheat Happens. Let's say you got a game pre-release, you got it early and you want to go ahead fool around on the game. You can do so with Cosmos. Today, I will be showing you how to edit your health value in the game Hogwarts Legacy. All right, guys, here we are in the game. Let's go ahead and get the show started. Let's launch Cosmos. You want to make sure you hit the cosmosbeginner.exe. On the start page, hit next. Select the game, which is Hogwarts Legacy, and hit next. All right, at this point, you can hit scan game or hit the scanner tab right here. Today, we will be searching for the health value. Now, of course, it is the green bar at the bottom right, and it does not have a numerical value. So what we're going to do next to search method, we are going to hit the drop down and select unknown value. And the value type is going to be a floating point value type. All right, let's do our first scan. And in the meantime, let's run around. We need an enemy. There should be one somewhere over here. There's an ugly toad thing. Let's go back to Cosmos. All right, so after the first scan, we found many matching results. We need to narrow it down. So let's go back into the game and we're gonna let that um, enemy hit us. And I want you guys to notice right here, there were 18 million results found on our initial scan. Uh, which is obviously way too much. Let's hit OK here. We're going to get hit. So let's change uh, the drop down to decreased. Go back into the game. Now we're going to aggro the enemy. And as soon as he hits us, we're going to pause and then flip back to Cosmos. All right. So he has a charge attack and also a like a lashing tongue attack. Yeah, we want to bait that attack right there. All right. So we're going to go forward. All right. As soon as we got hit, pause pull up cosmos and then hit next scan so basically what we're trying to do is whittle this number down now 818 million seems quite intimidating but don't worry about it all right second scan complete once again same uh, pop-up but now notice down here we have whittled 818 million down to 69 million uh, which is good so let's go back into the game once again and take another hit Remember, you want to pause on the hit. We're going to go here, bait that tongue attack. Come on, buddy. All right, hit, boom, switch over, and hit next scan. All right, let's hit OK here. At this point, we have gone all the way down to 924,000, which is way less than 818 million. So what you want to do, uh, you're going to hit the drop down here, and you want to hit unchanged, because a lot of these are, you know, just not what we're looking for we're actually looking for just the one value so we swap the search method to unchanged we're going to go back into the game and we're just literally just going to run around a little bit just run around get out of that guys oops wow didn't mean to do that well since we did that all right this guy is being hyper aggressive right now all right so we can go back here Let's go decreased. It's all good. Boom. Look at that. We are down all the way to 128 now. All right. So obviously we don't have any health. So we're just going to go ahead, pop a heal. Boom. Go back into the game. Actually, I'm going to pause, go back into the game. And under search method, obviously we healed. So that is an increase in health. And we are going to scan that. Boom. Down to 53. Let's hit OK here. Um, I'm going to go unchanged once again, go back into the game and just kind of run around once again, pull that back up, next scan, you're down to 10,000 now, pretty good. All right, hit okay. 
Unchange, hit next scan. Eight, I'm just gonna scan a bit. Seven, seven, three, 72, 71, 70, 33. At this point right here, we can go back into the game and change our health. Um, I will opt to take damage and look at our partner. He's just so conveniently placed there. All right, so decrease and scan 289 looking pretty good. All right, let's go here unchanged scan again scan again scan again scan again. All right, so at this point we want to go back into the game. Obviously, we need to heal or we will die. There we go. All right, so that was an increase. So we're going to go here increase and scan. Boom, we're down to 103. Let's hit unchanged, 76, 75, 71, 70. Let's take some more damage. All right, pause, boom, decreased and scan, 44. All right, so I'm gonna go back into the game now, pop a heal, pause, Back here, increased and scan. 33, unchanged. A few moments later. All right, down to 14. The Cosmos tells us you have found 14 results. Now you need to change the value in game and search for the new value. Be sure to pause your game before performing the next scan. All right, so what we're gonna do is hit okay here. And I'm going to hit the change this to unchanged. If you have this set to decreased and you go ahead and hit scan, you will have to start over for safety. Put that on unchanged, set that to unchanged. Uh, we can also do a scan here as well. All right, nothing doing. All right, so by process of elimination, we can go through each of these values and pretty much like, you know, just take them out. Uh, 0 0.4, that seems very unrealistic for some health. These two are out. And see, there's a 190 here. Um, this is like a single value. So we're gonna keep an eye on that one. We've got a few identical values here. This one is 74.53. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six values saying 74.53. So I'm actually going to rule them out as well. Uh, the 880 here um, seems very uh, unlikely that is our health. 880, no way. Same thing goes for 10. We have a 0 0.46 here. All right, so pretty much guys, it seems like I would say uh, our health is right here 190.99 so what we're going to do is select the value we're going to right click and add selected items to table all right so we're going to do that boom and right here as you saw there is a red dot next to table now so we're going to go to that tab and we're going to go ahead and change our value let's enter zero here well let's go Boom, as you saw that. So we did find our health value location. So all we need to do right now is go back into Cosmos on the table. And we're going to just set this to, to something crazy. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so it'll hit okay here. And then hit active. All right, let's go back into this game and get rid of this disgusting frog. Bang, as you saw right there. No damage. We are in God mode. Boom. And boom. There you have it. All right, guys. So there you have it. Easy, simple method to create your own cheats using Cosmos brought to you by CheatHappens.com. And remember, guys, that is absolutely free. Also, if you so desire, go ahead, check out and subscribe to Aurora take advantage of all these cool built-in cheats in a convenient trainer manager program options such as invisibility unlimited ancient magic One shot kills. Fast spell cooldowns.
and so much more. Anyway guys, that'll do it for today's video. Don't forget to hit that link in the description. Go ahead, download Cosmos for your free trainer options on PC. Thank you all for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.